Hey y'all, what's poppin'? I'm here today to give you five ways you can use black castor oil. Not only that you'll be using castor oil, I'm gonna give you five ways to use Puyo Essence 100% Haitian black castor oil. So, as you guys know, you've been following me for about three years with my hair journey, and I've been using Creole Essence as one of my staple products in my regimen, and my life has been flourishing ever since. The first way I use the Creole Essence 100% Haitian black castor oil is actually moisturizing my hair and my scalp. By doing this, I use it three to four times a week, massage it in my scalp, but not only that, that it has omega-3 fatty acids, it has rich vitamin E that helps strengthen and also activates the hair growth. That brings me to my second part. Not only do I use it for my hair, I actually use it for my eyebrows, my hairline, and also my beard. Yes, fellas, I'm calling you out, the beard. Beard game is strong, 2020, we gotta come up. Those are my little tips on using it there. Like I told you before, that omega-3, that vitamin E, that nutrients is just amazing. It's very thick and moisturizing for your hair, especially if you have thicker hair. Another way you can use it is deep conditioning. What I do when I deep condition, I pair it with my favorite deep conditioner and I'll add my 100% Haitian black castor oil to that deep conditioner. I mix it together. I apply it to my scalp. I massage it in, making sure I work it through roots all the way through my ends of my hair. I put a plastic bag on. I leave it in probably like 30 to 60 minutes with heat because heat is important. It's essential to go ahead and open that shaft up so moisture can be absorbed into your shaft. So that's what I do when I deep condition. I rinse it out and my hair feels fantastic. It's bouncy. My, my scalp is moisturized. And also it helps with the split ends that you have on the ends of your hair. Another way that I use Haitian black castor oil is for my dry spots. I take a few drops and apply it to my elbows, my knees, my ankles, my knuckles, or my driest area. So it locks in and seal in that moisture that you need after getting out the shower. I would also back it up with some cream to add it with just so I can have another layer of protection when using the 100% Haitian black castor oil. So that's what I do to moisturize that area of my body. The fifth way I use my Haitian black castor oil is actually for my cuticles. I don't know about you guys, but when I go to the salon and get my nails done, I always bring this with me, rub it in my cuticles because it strengthens your nails and it just gives it a nice glow and shine. So those are the five different ways that I use Quill Essence 100% Haitian Black Castor Oil in my regimen. Let me know if you guys have any questions, any comments, like let me know how you use your castor oil and what you use it for. Because